Well, as you can clearly see behind me, I must be in Holland. That is the country of windmills. It is a very flat country as well, and it lends itself to a morning like today when you had the clear blue skies for low angled, golden, warm light. Hi, I'm Brian Peterson, and I'm the author of Understanding Exposure and Brian Peterson's third edition of Learning to See Creatively. One of the challenges we face when photographing a landscape is to make what I call a storytelling composition out of it when we have all of the things necessary to make that story. And more often than not, a storytelling composition relies on a foreground, middle ground, and a background. This being the foreground, the middle ground being the pond, and the background, of course, being the windmill itself. Clearly, there's no wind today. We've got a still body of water allowing us to shoot a wonderful reflection. But one of the things that took place here moments ago during my workshop is I noticed several of my students had marched right up to the grasses, going past the grasses, and shooting the picture you see right here. What's wrong with it? Nothing's wrong with it, except it's missing the opening chapter. And by opening chapter, I'm referring to chapter one, the immediate foreground interest that is presented by these tall reeds of grass. Look at the difference between that photograph and now this one, where I back off and I incorporate that foreground. Look at those two side by side. On a personal level, I think it's much more compelling to have the foreground reeds of grasses because it creates a picture of greater depth and perspective. Now, of course, the beautiful warm light also accounts for this wonderful warm and inviting first chapter because that beautiful warm and gold light is on these reeds of grasses as well. Now, as far as the overall exposure here, this is classic storytelling aperture f22 so i'm using 22 and in this case focusing on the grasses and then adjusting my shutter speed until a correct exposure is indicated from this beautiful front light scene it's pretty simple 200 iso f22 at a 60th of a second at this particular time of day it's a pretty simple concept try to make the habit of using foreground interest and every single storytelling composition that you shoot going forward will always have that all-important chapter one. Hey, until next time, this is Brian Peterson saying, you keep shooting.